ari bafite ihema ryo buhamya bari mu butayo kuko yavuganye na Mose yamutegetse kurirema ari shushanyije n'icitegerezo c'ibyo yabonye ibyo basoko kuza bari hawe na base biba uruherekane barezanira Yoshua abagiye imbere ubwo yatsindaga amahanga ayimana yirukanye imbere yabo kugeza kuge Jadam it says uh, our father had a tabernacle of witness in the wilderness as he appointed instructing Moses to make it according to the pattern that he had seen which our fathers having received in turn he also brought with Joshua into the land possessed by the Gentiles who God drove out of before the, uh, the face of our father until the days of David <laughs> Uh, our ancestors had the tabernacle of uh, testimony in the wilderness. <laughs> Acts 7, uh, verses 44. I want us to read because I don't have a lot of time to explain. Uh, our fathers has the tabernacle of witness in the wilderness. Uh, that tabernacle was a sequence from Moses to Joshua to the Lord uh, The book of Matthew. Chapter 5, verse 16. Uh, chapter 5 verse 16 says let your lights so shine before men that they may see your good work and glorify your father in heaven so they can see uh, your good work and glorify your Father in heaven. What God do for us? It's for to return the glory of God. God never do uh, things for no reason. Even if you lose your kid, uh, your wife, your husband, God wants to produce the, uh, the testimony for his glory. Uh, the God, God said in the Gospel of Luke that he revealed himself in many ways so the people can turn to him. Uh, please listen, I have a short time. <coughs> Our Father has a tabernacle of testimony in the wilderness. That testimony was sequenced. And the sequence went up and it went down to the Joshua all the way to David. Uh, I got it from the, the Israelite, uh, so I want us to, to think about this testimony so we can glorify God 
because God be with our brothers. There are people that remember saying that God of Ganji. And those who said, uh, what can we do so we can say that God is powerful? I don't agree with you who said, people who said that God brought us in America to, to, to do the gospel. That's all we know. Praise be to God. Uh, answer me. If you ask anyone in Mwenge, they will say that God said that we come in uh, America to preach the gospel. 24 hours in the campaign. <laughs> Forty hours in the camp. Forty hours in the schedule. I'm not saying I'm going to ask you. Uh, the security was in that told us people who doesn't know English but they know the, uh, the English to argue the company. Uh, that English that you used to argue, what can she use to, uh, to preach to people? Our fathers had testimony in the wilderness. So it can be a secret so people can lift their eyes and say that God is powerful. Praise be God. Uh, I want to calm myself down because it's a lot of time. Nimbi mana yara kukuye mubirambo yaba. If God has brought you from the bodies of people, kwaro kubira bizina kya biza hamu. Mama is because he wants to glorify his name. Imana ni zamfa shikini kihe. God will not uh, hurt him at a time. Zaga ukano kukuya idati teyao. I'll come back to tell you your identity. You can't do the testimony if you don't have yourself. I told you last time about the, the girl, Carissa, that we used to go to the same church. He used to do, uh, he used to look good when he dressed. Where she dressed. One time we went uh, on a conference and then it took, to, it took a long time. Uh, the pastor told us, uh, Carissa, uh, you're proud. And he said, uh, he said, the pastor is uh, powerful. You can't do the testimony. So the God of uh, the name of God can be respected. If you don't know the sense of can be powerful. People come here and say that they, they are the people of the past. And others think they're the one who struggles. When they don't know that they're powerful, <laughs> they can't tell other people that uh, God is powerful. <laughs> you have to, uh, they have to be to believe that they're powerful. <laughs> and then you told the pastor that God is powerful. No, 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 pastor, you have to come and When pastor hear the power, the power of God, <laughs> and then God glorify you. <laughs> God doesn't do uh, be, uh, he doesn't waste time. What does it? Praise be God.
Let me say this testimony. One day, uh, David said that God killed the bear. And he killed the lion. 